So Kelsey, you've had a very busy morning in the Weather Control <laughs> Center today. Lots of watching the radar this morning, looking out for some possible storms heading our way. And we do have a chance of some scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms moving into the Treasure Valley through this morning. We saw a little bit of lightning moving through south central Idaho last night and we're clearing up by tonight for a sunny Thursday. But this is a look at our radar. We're seeing a little bit of those scattered showers moving through just to the southeast of us, kind of heading to the north east and right now we're relatively clear. Boise is just barely dodging these scattered showers, but we are expecting them to move through later on this morning. Right now we're at 72 degrees and winds have gone down to 5 miles per hour earlier today. They were about 13 miles per hour. And the temperatures around the region relatively warm this morning. 68 in Nampa and Canyon County, 55 in Stanley. They have some showers moving through this morning with some thunderstorms from last night. They had outflow gusts of wind last night in Ketchum, in Ketchum, Idaho, up to 54 miles per hour. But our forecasted high for today is a little lower than our normal t temperature for this time of year. 93 degrees is our normal, and we're hitting 88 by the late afternoon today. Our record high in 1990 was 106 degrees. The satellite and radar showing this low pressure system that started in Northern California is now heading really rapidly through the Treasure Valley and up into Montana. You can see we still have a little bit remnant storms moving through through this morning, but those are moving really quickly. So the Scattered showers and the isolated thunderstorms we'll be seeing today will be moving out by the late afternoon and possibly this evening. And that's going to be heading towards Montana. And then some warm, drier air is going to start to move in by tomorrow. And a high pressure system is going to keep us sunny for the next couple of days. The future cast is showing what that'll look like by, by around noontime. We're seeing lots of moisture up towards those central mountains there. And a little a scattered showers starting to move in by next Friday or by this Friday rather, but this is a clear Thursday right here. And as we fast forward into Friday night and Saturday early morning, you see a little more moisture moving in there for another shower that might be brushing by. But our extended forecast for this week, we're seeing those isolated showers move out by this afternoon and then sunny skies by tomorrow. And Saturday and Sunday, we're going to stay partly cloudy. Some more clouds moving in by Sunday and a little bit of brushing showers about a 20% chance of the showers moving in. Sunny by Monday and we're warming up to about 90 degrees. And up in those mountains, we're going to have some isolated thunderstorms up there as well. There's likely to be about a tenth of an inch of rainfall up in McCall and about 75 degrees for our high up there. And then another chance of some showers moving in on Sunday. But Friday and Saturday are going to be a good day to head up to those mountains. Sunny skies with 75 and 79 degrees as the high. And then Monday through Wednesday, a mixture of sun and clouds with the high near 80 degrees. And those overnight lows are sticking in the low 50 degree mark. Back to you, Kelsey.